Hey, congratulations. I'll let you catch your breath here for a second. <laughs> Our that One was America a full 500 sprint. <laughs> Our One America 500 Festival mini marathon winner catching his breath after making that final sprint. All right, he is uh, re receiving his uh, bouquet, his mini marathon hat, and his medal for winning the One America 500 Festival mini marathon. Can we talk to you? Tell me your name. Oh, my name is um, Conroy Lumkungo. It's great to meet you. What was that race like for you? Uh, the race was good. You know, it's uh, really uh, very nice you know, on the course. You know, many people cheering on us, and uh, I feel the weather was perfect. You know, today to run, uh, I tried to go as fast as I can, and I managed to run uh, uh, sub one hour, uh, sub 61, which was a good time for me. You were sprinting there at the end, so you had a lot left in the tank, and it appeared. Yeah, you know, after I ran uh, 10 miles last week in uh, Broad Street run, I went a uh, time of 45 minutes in Broad Street, and I tried to keep that pace uh, until mile 9, and then I just dropped off a little bit, and then I consumed the energy for the finishing line. What does it mean for you to win the One America 500 Festival Mini Marathon? Yeah, thank you so much, you know, for getting me back here. I was here in 2018, and I won the race with a time of 1 hour 03. And today, I just came back to just to make sure I run best time. Congratulations. Thank you so much. There's your winner of the Indianapolis Mini Marathon. Anne Marie? Well, they're working to confirm right now. Can you tell me about, do you think that potentially this is a new course record? We believe so, yes. Okay, and so what, what, what was the time that we're looking to We were confirm? at 101.52, and he was finished at 101.44. Wow. So we think that's the fastest mini ever. That's amazing. And uh, we didn't have any rain, no no puddles to, to walk around or dodge or it's anything It's been today. It's been nice and dry, but overcast and perfect day for running. So, yeah. and he really just, uh, he ran his own race for sure. That he was just, amazing to watch him come across that final stretch here and you know we were talking about there being a little bit of headwinds and we were feeling him earlier but not right now you know no, it's very still uh, it's just so perfect conditions but hats off to him that's yeah. awesome super exciting all right thanks so much